Oh boy, here we go. This home movie day has been going on at the Durham County Public Library for the past three years. Um, the best is always uh, people's home movies from growing up in different parts of the country, different times. When's the last time you'd seen that footage? I don't know, probably 20 years ago, I expect. My family did a lot of home movie nights when we would dig them all out or when people, relatives came, you know. My dad was always taking, taking movies. Film has lasted more than 100 years. This is a physical thing. After we can't use iPhones anymore or computers anymore, this is a physical thing that will exist that his son will be able, if they keep it cool and dry, will be able to show it to his kids. It's sort of like peeking into someone's private life uh, because this is something that you don't see at the movie theater on TV. This is real, actual life that happened. It's just, I don't know, something about reminiscence makes people happy and makes them remember things. So what I brought in today was some old 8mm reels, so I'm going back to about 1945. You remember this happening? No. <laughs> I remember living out there. I got online, looked at a search, how can I have these digitized, came across movie day, and here I am. This was all packed up in a, a storage tub that's moved with me many times and my children have been after me to who are the people in these pictures so that's what I've been working on for the last two years of photograph albums well, this is at Angie's church and my niece Angie got married in August of 1999 together they had uh, a daughter later on but that day was very important to me because it was one of the last full family gatherings before several elderly members of the family passed away. This is in Riverside, California, 1990. Someone asked me, oh, did they stay together? And I said, well, no, in fact, that same day. I saw her with the bro Libby chasing him. <laughs> A lot of fun and it's fun to see this and I can't wait to get it onto a DVD that showed my grandchildren.